It made little difference to the final result. France 11, Scotland 9. An exhibition in London gives motoring enthusiasts a look at the world of speed. An accessory supermarket is one important feature of the specialist sports car show. It's organized by the British Racing and Sports Car Club and the Daily Mail. Former world champion racing driver Graham Hill with Minister of Transport Mr. Fred Mulley who opened the show. The Lotus Europa model with a full BRM conversion. The Alfa Romeo Tipo 33 racing test bed powered by a 3 litre V8 engine. Television's Katie Boyle gets the feel of the new Barnard sports car designed for driver training. The WFH, a wood, brass and steel bodied vintage replica car based on an XK 120C chassis. Whether sports car or beach buggy, do it yourself plays an increasing part in motoring enjoyment. And vintage experts were delighted by the appearance of the number one MG, first registered in March 1925 and now fully restored. This is the Firestone F100 Royale, one of the first in a new formula of racing cars for club meeting. On to another sort of speed, the incredible acceleration of dragsters. Originally an American concept, drag racing is now a popular sport in South Africa where regular contests are held between these odd-looking vehicles. Conversions on saloons or the specially built open dragsters can more than double their acceleration. Of course, once past the line, they've got to be stopped somehow. It's an exhilarating business, but this time I think both drivers had the urge to stop. 